I'm John Larson, Technical Trainer for EpiRock Surface and Exploration Drilling USA. Today we're going to be talking about how to start the PowerRock T35 model. This is assuming we've already done our pre-shift inspection. Here we are on the non-cabin side of the machine after our pre-shift inspection. We'll locate the master switch, turn it to the on position. To start the rig, first we need to make sure that we have the correct procedure. To do this, we need the lower switch in the middle position, the middle switch in the turtle position or middle position, and the key switch in the stop position. To start the machine, we'll turn the key switch to the on position, and we'll wait for the Murphy gauge to light up and let us know that we're ready, noting that there are no fault codes in the Murphy gauge. Once we have noted that there are no fault codes on the Murphy gauge, we will sound the horn twice to clear anybody of the area, noting the engine is about to start. Then we take the key switch and turn it all the way to the right until the engine starts. To stop the engine, we simply turn the key to the off position. After shutting the engine off, and before turning the master switch off, we need to let the DEF fluid reclaim any unused DEF fluid from the system. To know when the DEF tank is purged correctly, you will hear the motor audibly stop humming. When the motor stops its cycle, now it is safe to turn off the master switch. If you need any further instruction or information on the starting or stopping procedure, refer to the operator's manual. If you need further assistance from these videos, please go to the website epiroc.us. That's E-P-I-R-O-C dot U-S. Or make note of our toll-free 1-844-437-4262. Or contact your local service center that's by Epiroc or your dealer.